I'm excited to announce the GA of local clusters for EKS on Outposts, enabling you to run highly available Kubernetes clusters in on-premises environments. With local clusters, we are now giving customers the ability to run the entire EKS cluster locally on Outposts. Instead of having an extended cluster architecture with a Kubernetes control plane and data plane in different environments. Local clusters run the same as EKS on AWS, and you can use the same tooling that you would use with EKS on the cloud. This includes automatically applied security patches. So how exactly does it work? Outposts are an extension of an AWS region. Unlike Amazon EKS clusters in a region, Outposts enable you to run Kubernetes clusters on-premises. With the GA of local clusters, you can now also run the Kubernetes control plane on the outpost. As the Kubernetes control plane and worker nodes operate in the same customer account in the customer data center, the local VPC network enables communication between Kubernetes control plane and the worker nodes. The clusters only support private endpoint access, and Kubernetes exposes the API server access through the local gateway. This is for connectivity from the local network. This ensures that only the right people can access and administer the cluster. By the way, a key advantage of this is that this all works even when disconnected from the AWS region, and your applications continue to be available because the entire Kubernetes cluster is in one place. This means you can also administer your cluster when disconnected, running things like kubectl commands to work directly with your cluster. However, when connected to an AWS region, you benefit from AWS managing that Kubernetes cluster. This includes things like using the EKS APIs and the console to manage your cluster. To communicate back to the AWS region, a service link is used. This is essentially an encrypted VPN connection. This communication path enables EKS to manage the availability of the cluster running on the outposts and surface a cluster in the EKS console, much like any other EKS cluster. It also enables outbound internet access for things like downloading ECR container images. The primary advantage with this architecture is that you can mitigate risk of application downtime resulting from network disconnections to the cloud. Because the entire cluster runs locally on outposts, apps remain available, and you can perform cluster operations during those network disconnects to the cloud. When connected to the cloud, EKS manages the availability of the control plane on outposts, simplifying Kubernetes operations. For some users, it may make sense to take advantage of the extended cluster architecture with the Kubernetes control plane running on the parent AWS region. This enables you to save capacity on premises. Note that the quality of the network connection here is critical, since network disconnects might lead to application downtime. Check out the links in the description below to learn more about local clusters on EKS on Outposts. Thanks for watching.